Cinematography to me is a combination of production design, directorial, and cinematography. You put them all together and that creates the sort of look of the show. It shows this nostalgic Los Angeles that I remember seeing on TV when I was young. Audiences are watching this show in their living rooms and they really do feel like they're in the 80s. And I think it's shot with, you know, the colors a little brighter, things a little more flashy, you know, to give it that element of, oh yeah, there was pieces of this time period where a lot of things were really screwed up, but bright and fun and loud, and, and I think the visual style really kind of reflects that. Our team behind the camera, they're like gentle giants. It's a pleasure to work with them because they're silent, but oh, they are stealth and, and deadly, and the shots are beautiful. I sometimes go behind the cameras like, show me what you're doing, show me what you're doing, because it just looks like paintings. I just told John Lindley in this past episode, I was like, what I would give to see what you see. Well, I never thought that I'd be working with the DP from Field the Dreams, first of all. It's dope. John's amazing. Well, Snowfall is set in the early 1980s in Los Angeles and it was a colorful period of time. And the designer and I have worked together with the, also with the wardrobe designer so that we try to tell the story partly through the colors of that era. The great thing about Snowfall is you can be very adventurous with your lighting, with your angles, your composition. You can shoot really low, you can shoot really dark, really whatever. The producers love it if it looks interesting and not like classic television. I'm just trying to figure out how they do it, you know? I'm just in awe. I'll just be on set. I go, oh, you can go break. I'm, and I'm just watching everyone do the job. I'm like, wow, like it's, it takes a team. This year I used uh, Vericams on this show uh, because I was interested in uh, a more sensitive sensor. And that allows me to take advantage of available light on night exteriors, on streets and places like that. I think new technology, you have to go with it. Because if you don't adapt to the new technology, you get left behind. We try and do a lot of work in one day, so it helps us to move quickly. With smaller lights, battery-powered lights, our gaffers come up with a whole section of LEDs that run on battery. Just bring the thing and turn it on. It's on an iPad, you can change the color. We really embrace all sorts of different colors. So it's a lot of fun to work that way. My goal for this show, photographically, is pretty simple. I just want to make it enjoyable to watch. I want it to engage the audience visually, and I want it to be fun.